is going wow. on? Oh, this is going to be a fortress. I just don't see any hopes at all. This is very easy. Just rook back and forth. Taking chess to the next level. Wow. Wow. Wow, yeah. Nothing else to say. Wow. Creating the future of the sport. Introducing the Champions Chess Tour. Ten months, ten tournaments. The world's best players online and on TV. And Queen takes F. Want to raise your chess to a new level? Challenge Yourself is an exclusive, innovative experience designed for Chess 24 Premium members. Train like a champ with a unique set of lessons prepared by the coaches of the challengers. Boris Girlfriend and Co. will help you improve your chess. Play versus a champ. Play a grandmaster each day in Banter Blitz. Take advantage of this incredible opportunity from June 10th. Go Premium and challenge yourself. Let's take someone with a random, with a random account, with a random name, but just see if they're trusted. Play live online against the world's top chess players while they stream their thoughts live. As a Chess24 Premium member, seize the chance to have your moment of fame. Get a peek inside their lives with question and answer sessions, in-depth teaching, analysis and interviews. The Champions Chess Tour, with countless accompanying events, is happening now. Tune in on Chess24. Hello, hello everyone. Uh, welcome to uh, Banter Blitz. Uh, it's uh, very soon uh, we get to play one more Banter Blitz, and uh, it's nice to nice to play another one. So you have a lot of chances. May maybe not really. So yeah, a lot of uh, um, uh, platforms. But uh, we'll try. I will try to uh, keep up with the chat, but uh, also. Uh, focusing on my own game and uh, you know talk some nonsense as usual uh, so it's uh, actually I came a bit earlier I see uh, it's just five <laughs> uh, so we'll, we'll uh, I have some challenges already I can see and uh, I have to take some okay I did play I did play
did I play against? No, I haven't. So, okay. And uh, uh, yeah, challenge me 3 plus 0 or 3 plus 2 or 5 plus 0. Uh, don't go, uh, don't challenge me bullet and uh, uh, so on. Um, yeah, so I will take my first challenge. Uh, against Ferruri. Ferruri, okay. Uh, okay, let's go knight f3. I, I I want to see where my opponent wants to go. Oh, maybe King's Indian or Grunfeld. No idea. Let's see. Still waiting. So he's a King's Indian player. A6. Um, it makes a lot of sense if I play D4. Uh, let's see what he wants after D3. E5, but then uh, A6 doesn't make so much sense because I, I just go B4, Knight D2. Hi, hi everyone. Uh, so D5 uh, is what uh, he would like to get. So let's go Knight E4. Now D, D5 is not so good because, uh, hey everyone, welcome. Uh, so that's why he's thinking actually if d5 then I just take knight f6 bishop f6 uh, and I win a pawn so he I don't know if it's a he or she but uh, let's see I prop oh bishop e6 that's interesting so uh, the threat of d5 uh, is renewed but uh, here there is one uh, I mean what happens after bishop to g5 uh, if knight bd7 then I take take on uh, d6 and uh, if h6 knight f6 bishop f6 bishop h6 and d5 I also win the pawn so maybe bishop e6 is uh, not so great Oh, h6. Uh, what happens after knight f6 and bishop h6? It seems that I I won a pawn without much of a compensation here. <laughs> I'm doing good, dangerous, right? How are you doing? Oh, monkey jokes are on <laughs> just 24 chat. <laughs> monkey jokes. Oh, did I just blunder my bishop here? I don't think so. Okay, if knight e4, king h7, yes, indeed. But I have so many moves here. I think I can go f4, something like f4. And uh, this should be winning. Oh. Um, okay, I don't have so much choice but let's say what happens if i just take f takes g5 bishop takes g5 knight e4 uh, followed by knight f6 check so he goes for uh queen e3 okay king h1 oh he missed this that's good good for me resign nice that's a gg let's take uh okay a player from argentina El Gua. Uh -huh, okay. All right. So let's go e4. Uh, today is a great day. I'm getting uh, <laughs> white pieces. Usually I am uh, I'm I'm getting all the time black. So this is great news for me. Uh, okay. So Sicilian. There you go. I'm not in the mood for playing something serious, so I'm just gonna play something simple with not much of a theory. Okay, rookie one. Hi, hi, Leoncito. Hello. <laughs> I, I don't think if you are prepared against me, it would help so much. 
because I'm not going to play my main stuff. Okay, this is all theory. So I think my opponent knows what he is doing right now. And I think this is the move. Um, is this the, oh yes, that is, this is, this is correct. And is it queen d4 or bishop d4? I'm not sure about this move, knight takes, knight takes d4. Um, so I'm just gonna go bishop d4 and see what he wants. Okay, so c4. Just simple development with knight c3. And maybe queen f3 depending on uh, how he moves. Okay, bishop d7. I think it's a good move. Um, maybe I should have exchanged uh, exchanged the queens. Okay. So what do we got here? Ninety four is nothing special. Yeah, this is good move. This is a good move by my opponent. Um, now I don't see what to do. Okay, let's develop normally when you don't understand. Just rook d1 and... Wow. That's actually a good move. That's a good move. If queen a4, queen d4 and uh, seems pretty good whoa nice so i don't want to do that so he's gonna go bishop c6 here what okay i don't understand anything here okay queen e3 this is really brave what he's doing so knight g4, oh, okay, he wants to get knight g4. Frankly, I don't understand anything. <laughs> but uh, on the other hand, it did confuse me a lot. So h3, stopping knight g4. Uh, right now, my main problem is time. Position is not really my problem here. Okay, bishop to b6. Maybe queen d2. Okay, let's let's move this this gentleman from here. All right. Now Let's also get the rook. Okay, let's get b4. <laughs> yeah. Now I like my position. Hmm, 94 is a good move. All right, so let, oh no, 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 no. Uh, what happens after b5 takes, takes, queen c2, uh, rook d2, no, it's too much. That's probably not going to help. Okay, let's go. Bishop looks a bit weird on b6, but I have a nice control over uh, what? Did he just offer a draw? Why would you do that? I'm not gonna ex accept a draw here. I don't mind losing and yeah, I'm probably losing here.
this is bad okay let's try something Oh, this is with increment. probably very bad um, but I will try to survive here uh, let's see let's see if I can somehow make it work wow group G6 Why did he play rook g6? This was tough. I'm not sure I I survived this, but this was really tough. Whew. I think I'm drawing somehow, but uh, yeah, not an easy game. Yeah, okay. Maybe not the best, but okay, he's not losing it. Ah, come on. Okay, it's going to be a draw. 
It's a good game. Okay, let's take somebody. Oh, once again, white. Oh, cool. Where is my opponent? It's from France. Uh, I was not talking actually. That's why it was not coming. Okay, let's go. My position was so bad. Yeah, now it seems okay. This is good position. Uh, uh -huh. What happens after something like knight to f5? Um, yeah not really working is it i thought knight f5 looks good yeah somehow knight f5 okay knight f5 let's go in something like queen b3 i want to take the pawn on d5 <sighs> looks good Uh, can I go knight d6? Yeah, I think knight d6 looks good. Bishop d6, bishop d6. And bishop f4. We win. We win. Okay, we have two bishops, but doesn't mean it's winning. Uh, knight f4 is possible but uh, then i will lose this pawn on e2 if i play e3 okay let's go e3 why not yeah i think he thought that he's winning with this but i can go bishop c7 people and after b5 bishop a5 it looks good okay now i have bishop a5 and i control all the squares it looks good Actually, bishop h3 was winning an exchange. Okay, let's exchange the queens. Have lo I'm low on time, so I have to do that. Okay, so first part is done. And now how do I win it? So... Um, okay, knight b1, knight d2, knight b3, and knight c5. So nice, knight b1, knight d2, knight b3, and knight c5. Okay, knight e4 is uh, a good move, so let's not exchange the, our knight bring the rooks and then take knight a5 knight c6 mm -hmm. but what happens after knight a5 i think he s kimlam did not see that i can just take knight c6 and i'm a pawn up Oh, wow, what is c5? Uh, okay, thank you for the pawn. And what about this horsey here? 
why am I not playing Meltwater? Uh, it's not something which I have to, I can answer. Uh, okay, let's take this. This was horrible. <laughs> I was thinking too long. Okay, let's take the next one. Oh, finally it got black. Okay, I actually played a couple of times, I think. Um, I think he's from France, Uncle Scrooge. Okay, <laughs> that's not his real name. Yeah, I should have, uh, I should have done better than that. I was just too slow. I think white is maybe a bit better here. Yeah, definitely. But okay, we'll see. We'll see how he is able to progress. Knight, uh, knight d2. Okay, that was unexpected and I'm very happy about that move. Yeah, if b3 then I go knight h5, I think this is good. At least I I managed to win his bishop. Um, okay, let's take it. And uh, now just, just to play some two bishops endgame. And I guess uh, if I manage to bring uh, bring the knight somehow to h5 or c5 with pawn on a5 that will be awesome uh, but that's not so easy actually quite difficult <laughs> oh, he, oh no 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 he did not fall i wanted to play bishop b2 but then he has knight f5 bishop c1 knight e7 king g1 oh yes it wins he did fall for the mistake. Uh, yeah, knight f5, bishop c1 looks good. Aha, uh -huh, knight f3. But then I, I just win. Um, yeah this this should be quite good so 
maybe uh, rook d6 c5 is there so let's bring the bishop back not to allow any kind of e4 and then i bring the knight uh, to d7 c5 absolutely no chance h6 i have knight g4 so white must take the pawn uh e3 mm -hmm. okay let's let's uh, disturb this knight on f3 so we can get the rook to d2 yeah that's uh, that's actually a good move uh but okay exchange is exchange i don't really care so if i go rook it if a2 he, he has b5 right okay and rook c8 i i mean how do you defend this eight uh -huh. rook b1 okay let me first defend everything okay rook b8 check doesn't help at all because just king g7 ah knight e2 okay takes i can take c4 pawn as well and then uh, just push okay so it's good game finally i won a game and uh, okay somebody challenged me unrated five minutes and uh, okay let me take that yeah just 24 new play zone would be nice uh, since more than one uh, okay where is fide arena gm uh, i'm not sure if he is here okay so i have to abort and accept another player i guess where is abort ah it's here okay let's accept someone else yeah sometimes i ma uh, manage to uh, <laughs> accept the challenge from uh, non-premium members uh this is only for uh, premium member guys so okay let's see he, it's alias fighter hmm. once again white pieces i'm so happy today Uh, yeah, I think uh, knight f6 was preferable th uh, than bishop to g7. Here, of course, I get uh, d5 next move. Yeah, yes, dangerous ride it is. <laughs> Today, <laughs> I, I, I get all white pieces. It's good. It's good. In fact, uh, there was uh, some hand and brain or no. Yeah, it was hand and brain and I, uh, all the time we had blacks. Yeah, now I think d5 looks good. It would be really tough for the bishop on c8 to come if I managed, oh, knight e5. Okay, let's take this and uh, bishop to d3 okay so this looks okay so far if knight knight to e7 maybe can i go bishop g5 or yeah bishop g5 looks quite tempting yeah let's do that Uh, bishop h4 and then bishop g3 but all on the other hand to play all these moves like h6 g5 
Yeah, Fide Arena GM, where did you go? <laughs> uh, yeah, Knight E4 looks nice now, but G5, Bishop G3, E5. Okay, let's first take this and to see how how alias fighter is going to defend this. Okay, Rook E1. Now there are lots of ideas. Oh. Um, there is a nice idea to take on g6 with the bishop. I am going to do that. Hopefully not missing anything. Hi, Blunder Panda. <laughs> yeah, we need more blunders from you. Uh, so can I can I go bishop to c2 and queen d3 to checkmate? Yeah, maybe let's do this. I, it looks great. Oh yes, of course knight g6. How could I miss that? Bishop g3. Well, at least uh, uh, queen uh, d6 is an idea. Now I can play knight d5 or queen d3. Queen d3 looks good, but then he has f5. Hmm. Uh, yeah. Let's go knight d5. It looks good. Actually, I have no idea what's my next move. Uh, oh, bishop d5 is very good. Bishop d5 I like. Just take queen d5. Wow, he just missed bishop g6 here uh, after bishop a1, rook a1. And uh, that should be quite easily winning. <laughs> yeah, rook a1. And all I need, oh, queen e6, okay. Uh, queen e6, I can just play bishop f5 or. Mm. Oh, no, I have to play fast. And rook c1, rook c7 should be the way. If rook e7, I have bishop h4, f6, bishop e6. Okay, let's go. Rook c3, rook g3. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. That helps, definitely. Uh, e7. Bishop h4, rook f3, and rook f8. Okay, g3. Okay, gg. That was cool. Cool stuff. Uh, oh. Okay, let's play Fide Arena GM. One more chance. What? E4, Knight, C6. Okay, I don't allow you to get the pawn. What do you do? E5. There you go. Let's do this. <laughs> I don't think bishop c5 is so good uh, because I can just play knight e5 and uh, yeah, I don't know. Bishop c5 is not the move. Yeah, king f2. I think I can play d4. Oh no, wait. 
that can be quite dangerous but i go d4 let's see ah knight g6 so so easy h4 is very tempting here but okay let's let's be behave normal Yeah, maybe knight f6. Uh, okay, now uh, simply I go rook f1 and king g1. Uh, this looks very good. <laughs> yeah. yeah, now it's bishop g5 and just I, I take on f6 or even knight d5. Um, yeah, this didn't go well for Fide Arena GM. Yeah, I would like to uh, get knight to d5, but we will see. Ah, uh, bishop e6. Okay, I'm not going to take that for sure. So, oof, oof, oof. let's take this. I like this move and uh, bishop to d3 maybe queen f3 queen f6 or queen h5 so many ideas it should be pretty bad ah so queen b6 is a kind of idea so king h1 first oh d5 is really bad d5 is a move which you should not play because it opens my bishop on d3 obviously if if the pawn is on e4 you know it, i have to do something to attack but uh, now it uh, things become very easy let's i'm going queen h5 but i actually don't see anything Yeah, now oh, rook f4 is a huge mistake. I mean, there is this bishop g2 check, king g2 and knight f4. At the same time, I don't know how I win this. Well, I'm just probably... Uh, yeah, don't play rook f4. Uh, that's all I can say. I can play something simple. Let's take queen d5. He's gonna take queen d5. Yeah, then I'm just going to collect this, bring the rooks, not a great move, king g1, well, but the point is that uh, his pawns are uh, doubled, oh, rook e6 is good, I didn't see that, yeah, that, that, uh, that was not a good move. Yeah, now my problem is after uh, no he wants to go rook b6 and rook uh, somewhere so i play c3 then he goes rook e8 hmm that's not good but what can i do uh king f2 knight f4 and uh, g2 pawn will be hanging at the end yeah i need to move the rook and get rook d2 rook e1 rook f2 maybe keep keep some pressure on f6 yeah i, I think uh, just 24 new play zone should be ready pretty soon then of course we have more uh, pre moves more than one okay right now what is happening i don't like it so much but he he just made some mistake he made a mistake he goes rook b6 uh, after a rook e6 that's the problem h4 okay did i miss something if i take what's going on 
Yeah, take. Okay, just king f2. I depend everything now. Yeah, something he missed because this this doesn't concern me at all. I can just play rook d7. Yeah, maybe a4, a5 could be nice. Aha, knight f8. Uh, is this something which I should be worried? No, definitely not. Knight to h7. Oh, that's... Uh, it, it was so stupid of me not to see that. Okay, let's take this. Uh, thankfully, he didn't give a rookie to check, but that could have been quite annoying. So, a5. And how do we win this? Rook to d6. At some point, I need king g to rook f2. So, I'm just waiting for that. Yeah, Monkey King has always some interesting stuff there. Uh, should I take? Oh no, why I should take? I go Rook D8. And then I can... Ah, yeah, now this is good. This looks winning. Uh, did he forgot that I am a pawn up? Or he doesn't care? Okay, c4. Well, all the end games are lost for him here. Okay, let's uh, take this. g4 and king f3, king e4 and c5. Uh, it's pretty lost. Okay. Hmm, let's put this pawn here. Just king f5 and okay, I can also go g5, but king f5 is good. Uh, okay, f takes g5, king e5 and... Hmm. This was not uh, not bad. This was good game uh, by me after a long time. Hey Ferrari, we already played. Okay, so Blunder Panda, give me the blunders, but uh, not so easy. Blunder Panda is very tricky. All right, let's go. <laughs> yeah, it this uh, is something which is uh, known stuff, but I hope Blunder Panda is prepared for this. I'm not sure. Bishop to d6 is quite strange. Let's go. Oh, wow. Oh yeah, he keeps on playing this, I remember. Yeah, I do remember this. Yeah, why do you play this? I never understood why Blunder Panda keeps playing this. But he likes it, okay. Uh... Ah, maybe he, Blunder Panda is ready for it. Knight to a4 or knight to e2. Okay, let's go knight a4. Knight to e4. Okay, so I castle and just rook e1. I don't see what's going on here. 
Yeah, I'm just waiting for Blunder Panda to <laughs> blunder. <laughs> You're welcome, Fidel in a GM. King to e7. Okay, so I do think that I should bring the bishop back somewhere. So bishop to b3. And I think rook e1 is coming. So I don't exactly know what is this whole opening which Mr. Blunder Panda played here. Oh, he does have a move which he did not see. Actually, bishop d4 was quite interesting. But he's blunder panda, he doesn't see it. So now I am threatening to play f3. Okay, so king f6 is good. So if I go f3, what do you want, my friend? Oh, there was also g4, which was quite interesting. So bishop to d4. Um, king f1 can be slightly dangerous because of some knight g3, bishop d3, and rook e8, and so on. So let me do this. Bishop e3, rook e3. Oh, he's good. He's doing good. Uh, knight g5 I think this is not so good um, but how do I win it so I have a nice uh, trick here should I make him fall for that or I should play simple okay let me play simple Uh, yeah, now g4 looks good. Where is this bishop running? Because after bishop c8, I have rook c1 and c6 pawn is hanging. Yeah, I think this uh, whole thing which he is playing, he should go for... Uh, uh, he should go for something good, not like this. Blunder Panda, it's time to change your reporter. Good game, good game, Blunder Panda. I'm very happy that I won this. Uh, yeah, now I have a very interesting, uh, interesting opponent. Let me win. I'm not going to let you win. I will try my best, but... Uh, bishop to c4. Okay. Yeah, I... Often I have been asked in uh, in my course this move bishop c4 which looks ridiculous against uh, time one of structures. Um, the main well there are many points which why it is bad uh, but the main reason is uh, that you are not really threatening anything here and uh, I can just play something like knight f6 e5 d5 Yeah, for example, after f4, I can go d5. Yeah, actually, my students can just see this game, and I think this is enough.
yeah this looks good he uh, whoa bishop b3 wow let's go c4 go back 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 and uh, now what should we do knight c6 should we go bishop to c5 or bishop c5 looks so good oh i can even threaten to take the pawn on f4 uh d3 okay let's take let's just castle okay you can take the pawn if you want no it doesn't want okay no worries and here we already uh, reached something nice as you can see now i am threatening too many things uh, bishop f5 what all oh there are so many things going here okay let's go bishop c5 and uh, wow let's go knight g4 want to get knight f2 maybe an exchange yeah blunder panda you <laughs> but i think uh, he uh, you 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 did play this uh, this variation already against me in uh, some other banter blitz so i do remember because you are the only one who plays this and i was thinking like why does he why does uh, blunder panda keeps doing this but see i can't have complaints when i am winning a game right Yeah, now it's uh, it should be winning. And I think something like bishop f5 or I I mean sadly I cannot let let me win win this because of many reasons. First of all, he's he's exchanged down and he's exchanging more and more pieces which is good for me yes blender panda you should change this you should change this opening <laughs> i agree with that Well, actually, I think you did have some uh, chances, Blunder Panda, afterwards. But uh, somehow, King E7 is too optimistic, I, I believe. All right. So, uh, what happens to F6? He has Knight D7, or what? What is going on after F6? Oh, hey, Chess Trash Talker. Are you good chess trash talker or bad chess trash talker? Rook e6. Oh, now I just win a pawn. Um, I can go knight b4 or knight e3. Okay, let's go knight b4. It looks good. It looks good. And then rook c8 okay knight a3 uh it's time to exchange the rooks okay sorry let me win i couldn't let you win um I, I now forgot whom all against whom I played. <laughs> um, okay, let's 
Did I play against Monkey King? I think I did now, right? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Chess Chess Talker. Chat, did I play against Monkey King? Okay, I didn't play. All right, let's let's give Monkey King a chance. So we will see. Let's go, Monkey King. Okay, now I will change. I will change from the time on off to Karokan. I'm not sure if I should go Bishop F5. Uh, okay, let's try Bishop F5. Why not? Life is good, Ivan. Life is good. Um, oh, Bishop D3. Yeah, actually, this is kind of uh, theory. I'm not sure. Okay, let's take this. <laughs> yeah, somehow you... Uh, yeah, Bishop C4, I think uh, this could be a nice, nice game for my students. No, just go for uh, Blunder Panda, just go for uh, Queen's Gambit Declined for the starters. I think it suits you. It's solid and uh, you don't need uh, too much preparation uh, to play that. Yes, yes, you need uh, 2500. Uh, uh, LO rating uh, plus 3 GM norms. But uh, at first, I think you should just start uh, focusing on improving chess because, uh, uh, well, you you will get the uh, norms uh, in no time, but uh, it's important to improve chess strength. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Mantos. Yeah, that would be nice. Then I will probably uh, lose all the games to you guys, and then you can uh, you can get GM norms. Yeah, what a nice idea. <laughs> I don't have website. I don't have website, but uh, there are two courses of mine on Chessable, uh, where I uh, uh, this is for Chess Trash Talker. And uh, I had two courses and uh, the third one is uh, soon going to come. Uh, oh, queen c3. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure actually what is this queen c3. But on the other hand, I don't have really such a great ideas for black either. <laughs> yeah yeah don't don't worry about the results in panther blitz that's all i can say okay when when we have a chance to take the bishop let's do it So e4, I would uh, play gladly. Um, okay, b5 is actually a nice move. Uh, and now it's time to double the rooks here. Okay, so we have uh, completed the whole... <laughs> operation of this whole thing everything is good now all i need to do is wait for monkey to go crazy yes blunder panda my next course will be on endgame uh, on chessable it uh, i i will soon uh, start recording hopefully uh, i will finish uh, soon 
Okay, let's go queen f4. I mean, sometimes this queen can get trapped here. Uh, it, <laughs> yes, I do think that uh, in order to improve chess, you should uh, definitely um, focus on playing positional stuff as well. Uh, otherwise, uh, after a while, it, it gets really tough uh, to develop those skills. Yeah, now b6, c5 maybe, but the thing is also he has these rooks on d1, d2 quite nice. Um, black is not worse here, but at the same time, I really don't see any concrete. Uh, Queen's Gambit decline course is already there, I think. Uh, who, who made that? Uh, is it Alex? I think it... it uh, yeah, I think it's Alex. Alex made the course, so you can check check that course. This is not a good move, but I will make it anyways. Yeah, exactly for this reason I didn't want to play. But what to do? Let's go for it now. Let's do this. Yeah, also Sam uh, made some uh, many courses. I actually don't remember see, since he made so many uh, courses from both white, black. Yeah, now it's time for this uh, pawn, a pawn to just go. Uh, my air quality is pretty good. Thanks for asking. Okay, actually rook 1 d4, I don't know what I would have played. Uh, but this is, uh, I think, quite slow. Since I'm just gonna play a2 next after rook d7. Oh, rook d4. Yeah, rook d4 would have been nice. But now I can go a2 since after rook b4, queen check and bishop to b bishop takes b4. Yeah, I think he missed this. Oh, I had auto promotion. That's so dangerous. Uh, okay, bishop. Oh, luckily it's not a blunder. Luckily it wasn't. <laughs> But <laughs> I didn't see that uh, the knight on f3 is capturing that. So I have queen e1, then queen d2, and uh, this is just winning. Okay, good game, monkey king. Um, so, okay, let's see. Let's see just trash talker. I hope he is premium. Yeah, he is. Um, okay, let's go knight c3. He wants, he's trash talker, so. Okay, all right, let's do this. I give you a pawn. He doesn't take. <laughs> Why don't you take the pawn? I'm so embarrassed now. Welcome monkey king. All right, now we got some, some sort of King's Indian, <laughs> not exactly, but uh, reasonable. I mean, <laughs> I would have liked to have the pawn on G3, but uh, Having the pawn on g4 has uh, some advantages here. Okay, let's go. For example, this one. So bishop to f4. Oh, just trash, trash talker knows his stuff. I thought he was. <laughs> Let me win. 
that was a really nice uh, nice handle so i i'm not entirely sure if i should go short castle or long castle oh uh, maybe this short castle is good wow okay uh i'm not sure if this is good but i'm just gonna take it anyways chest trash talker i offer you pawn you don't take it i offer you peace you don't take it don't blame me if you lose this game which you will Yeah, now the GC, I mean, you have only 98. I don't see any other way to defend that. And after that, I can just take Queen G4, uh, just a pawn up. G6. Oh, you want to lose quick. Yeah, Queen G7 is coming next. GG. So nice. This is, this is, this is great. This is great. Um, <laughs> okay, I got to take this name as well. <laughs> Ruthless decision. <laughs> All right, let's go. No, I don't think so. I don't think so, Mantos. <laughs> it, this is really a ruthless decision to play. Uh, but is it rated? Yeah, it is. But you need to play fast. Oh, but now I have e4 and well, I can claim that I'm winning, but uh, to be honest, I have no idea. Yeah, I just go bishop d3, e5 and kick this knight from f6. Mm -hmm. Bishop to g4. Surprising. Okay, let me ask. Where you want to go with this? If bishop f3, I'm going... Oh, why? No problems. <laughs> well, not always. Hi, Zevich. <laughs> yeah, no trash talking, just trash talker. Okay so it's time to sacrifice some things so let's sacrifice a knight yeah i have lots of challenges and uh, trying to you know give chance to people who have who did not play but of course i will I accept uh, those if i have already played Yeah, I need to get e5 and queen h5, then the game is over. But that's not something which is going to happen soon. But my opponent doesn't know that. It's time to attack. Actually, my queen, my uh, peace sacrifice isn't that bad. I was too harsh on myself. Oh, he took. Okay, take. Hmm. F5 is good. That's a good move. And that is how I probably have bad position. 
this is the time when I regret <laughs> sacrificing um, sacrificing the piece but okay let's see something will come up I hope give me something what can i do here uh, okay let's save this bishop for a moment because i want to go queen g4 rookie one and bishop b3 check yeah it's it's a good idea it's a good idea to save that uh, and knight d7 obviously is is the best. What can I do here? So queen d3. Oh, queen d3 is good. No, it's not. Why did I play this move? Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, bishop, bishop e five, e seven. Somehow this doesn't look good. Uh, yeah, this this does definitely doesn't look good. Hmm. Ninety five. Uh, if I go queen to g3, how does that? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I have a bl No, I don't have. Actually, my position is quite lost here. But... Uh, not sure if my opponent realized that wow wow that is brutal man okay what just don't understand but he had ruthless decision this is really ruthless decision but why you need it why did you take this uh yeah i should have given check obviously it was my mistake taking h1 um yeah now now he's gonna get back uh knight e1 um okay king h2 actually rook f3 was really very nice move but rook h3 was completely unnecessary um here it's probably okay for me or still it's maybe lost okay rook d1 at least if i manage to exchange one rook uh, that could be nice for me have to go f4 yeah maybe i'm it's not lost oh bishop d6 okay this i'm happy this i'm really happy so i take take yeah this was not really interesting game because my opponent was probably winning um if i if he had just gone uh rook to e8 okay right now this is lost um i think so I mean whenever I say it's lost somehow I miss it so rookie six stopping any kind of 
counter for the knight and then I go rook e2 and capture the knight. So this was uh, rook c1 uh, was something which I was considering but uh, black had uh, the move rook to e8 and that was the reason why I did not play that. Wow rook c8 that was too deep. Okay, so let's have the rook on d2 and just push the pawn. Okay, I need to play quick. Faster, faster. And exchange the rook. Okay, let's wait. Okay, this is no chance. Yeah, this I will I will win as well. Okay, it's a good game. But this was pretty interesting uh, after my unnecessary sacrifice. Um, yeah, let's take on uh, Monty twenty four from Singapore. I guess yeah. Oh, he drew a game against me. That's interesting. Let's go e five. Uh, you mean the Berlin snow lip snow leopard wow so do you mean the Berlin shall I play Berlin no I don't play the Berlin yeah ruthless decision it was really good game it was pretty interesting yeah Spanish is uh, quite popular but uh, um, yeah it's difficult difficult to say Okay, this is all theory. It's called prayer. And I'm pretty sure that there are lots of courses on this as well. Yeah, this this is uh, quite uh, quite popular. Lots of games in this. All the action is about the discussion uh, with the pawn on e4 and d4. Um, so, of course, knight f1 is uh, another way to continue. Yeah, here I, um, black can play b4, I think, but uh, I'm just gonna play something simple, it's c6. So basically, I uh, white would like to somehow, um, yeah, b3 is is rise, nice. Uh, white is trying to exploit the fact that uh, pawn is already on b5. Of course, the like it's really strategic. Uh, I mean, it takes a lot of maneuver. Pieces are moving here and there, but it's quite interesting, and uh, you can win a lot of points if you are able to do it. If you are able to play well um, okay so whenever uh, white is trying to undermine or close this uh, you know attack on b5 it's it's not a bad idea to open up a bit so knight d4 maybe uh, here I have the option to go c5 but then I don't know what to do after that so let's first go bishop g7 so something like yeah th this is okay uh, I would I would guess that b take c4 shouldn't be bad but um, not very happy about it let's go let's go b takes a4 and at some point we are going to see d5 but when d5 happens you are going to see that you know everything is a um, lot of drama will happen after d5 that much i can tell you so i take or um, let's go d5 i like d5 
Oh, e5. That's uh, a surprising move, in fact. What if I go knight d7? He wants f4. Or. Mm -hmm. Okay, now things get quite complicated. Let's go knight h5. This is good because we get knight f4 and something like queen g5. Uh, I expect either knight 2f3 or 4f3. Yeah, knight 4f3 uh, defending. And it's a good time uh, to capture this. And uh, now c5 is good. Yeah, and this is the move which I was hoping for. Otherwise, a6 pawn uh, is lost. So knight f4, queen c2, and now queen to d5. Now we can have knight d3. Wow. That move is not possible, my friend, because of knight g2. If king g2, queen f3, um, it's I have nothing to say. If not... You know, this is the good part about the prayer. Uh, it looks pretty dull and nothing uh, nothing much is happening. But when d5 happens in, uh, in a nice way, uh, black is just going to win in no time. It's just six moves after d5 and we have this. So that's a nice way uh, to describe that. Uh, okay, let's see. All right, let's go. R arena de playa. Oh yes, he is. He is. Yeah. Okay. So. <laughs> All right, my friend. Let's see what you got. I hope I can remember my own course. Oh, you don't play my own my course. Too bad. Uh, okay, knight db5. Yeah, I don't mind playing this. So we finally reached some uh, kind of Sveshnikov. Or maybe, I mean, it can be slightly different. <laughs> yes, Iron Matt, I am having a wonderful time with <laughs> No, but I had lots of uh, difficult games in, at the beginning. At the beginning it was tough. But later on it became better. Uh, B4. Oh, Knight C4. That's interesting. So I get the Knight out. This is new. This is new. Normally, you don't want to have, uh, you don't want to give this option. Uh, okay, so what's going on here? Uh, if I go knight b6, then you have rook b8. Okay, let's see what what is the idea of this whole setup. Maybe it's some kind of preparation. I hope I I sh I think what I'm doing should be okay. Bishop to e6. Uh, yeah, let's ask this question after queen a4. What's the idea? King f8. Hmm. Oh, bishop to d7. Okay. So now if I take knight d6 check, king f8, queen a7, what is his idea? If I don't see it, I go for it. Knight c2 is not possible because I have bishop c2. So maybe white is just a pawn up.
Yeah, for force moves, don't think. I mean, King F8 is uh, is kind of forcing. Uh, King F8, King G8, and uh, okay, let's castle first, and then I get Rook C1, Rook C7. Oh, Bishop E6. So the idea of Bishop E6 is to take Bishop D5, he takes D5 and Bishop E7. And how do we fight against that? Maybe Knight B7. I didn't really like Knight F6, Queen F6, some kind of Knight F3, Bishop H3 options. Actually, white black does have some compensation. It's not without. Okay, this is cool. I like this now. Once the bishop on e6 is gone, there's just uh, absolutely no no counterplay. I expect f takes e6. Okay, so knight e3. I don't want to take the bishop on f6. It's it's not very useful. Now just rook c1 and uh, develop pieces normally. Oh, g6, okay. So rook c1. Oh, rook a7. Yeah, still there is there is fight. Okay, knight g4. I want to see what where this bishop is going. Oh, okay. Uh, all right. So far it looks fine. So rook f d1. Actually, this is not a good move. I should have played queen c5. Yeah, exactly. So knight to e3. Why didn't I go queen c5? Bishop to g5 played with once 0.1 uh, second. <laughs> uh, now I can go queen c5 and uh, queen takes e5. So that's uh, that's gg and uh, guys. Yeah, yeah, so that's uh, the last game. And uh, thank you very much. And uh, we'll see in uh, next Banter Blitz. And uh, have a nice evening and uh, take care. Want to raise your chest to a new level? Challenge Yourself is an exclusive, innovative experience designed for Chess24 Premium members. Train like a champ with a unique set of lessons prepared by the coaches of the challengers. Boris Girlfriend and Co. will help you improve your chess. Play versus a champ. Play a grandmaster each day in Banter Blitz. Take advantage of this incredible opportunity from June 10th. Go premium and challenge yourself.